serves continue to be aggressive behind the line. GoCrayton.com here with Megan Sharkey after a 3-2 victory. Megan, uh, different result today. We got the win. What was the key? I think the key was just coming out strong. We had aggressive serves today, which really helped us get them out of system, and then that prevented us from having hard-driven balls back at us. So I think our aggressive serving really put us on the top today. You're one of seven newcomers in this program. How, how much of uh, an advantage is it that you you actually arrived in January, but the chance to, to work out and get some competitions under your belt before arriving back to campus in August, how much does that help? It's helped a lot. Um, I think it's definitely helped with nerves for sure, and just to get used to comfortable setting before, I mean, August rolls around, and so just extra practice with the coaches, feedback, and we're meeting all the girls really helped. And the last question, just uh, we've spent a couple days now in Budapest. Uh, what's What's been your favorite part so far? Um, I think the boat tour last night was really cool to be able to see the city, especially at night. So when it was all lit up, I thought that was really awesome, a really awesome experience. GoCreighton.com here with Kirsten Berntal Booth after a 3-2 victory on Sunday. Coach, uh, different result today. What was the key? What did you like? Oh, we didn't play very well today. I mean, we looked so tired. Um, you know, I kind of knew going in, we've been running on a, a, not a lot of sleep and we took a big walking tour today. So I can't say I, I liked all that much of what we did today. I thought we played far better against the Slovenian team. But, you know, it is good to get a win and we got to, you know, throw a lot of different lineups out again. We played the last game with just the underclassmen, so that was kind of fun. So, you know, we're still getting a, a great list of things that they can go back and work on in July on their own. So that's real beneficial, but we look tired today. It's been a couple days since we uh, talked to you. Just tell us about what, what you've liked best about being in, uh, in Budapest and, and finishing up time in Slovenia. 
Oh, yeah. I mean, just Budapest is exquisite. I'd heard over and over what a beautiful uh, city it is, but the architecture is amazing. We had a phenomenal tour guide today, so we learned a lot of stuff. Um, and then Slovenia uh, is a lot, it seemed Midwestern to me, just really nice people, beautiful countryside. Um, yeah, we've had great experience. Budapest is a much faster city, obviously, than Marabor, um, but it's been a great experience, I think, for, for all of us. All right, thank you.